Hello, this is Patrick Archibald, and this is a demonstration of how to use the Google Calendars View application. Okay, when you first call it up, the first thing you're going to need to do is add your Google accounts. So we hit the Add button. I'm going to add my work account. I'm going to add another account, my personal account. Okay, so we've got two accounts created. Hit the cancel button and let's create a view for my work account. Let's call it my department. Goes out there to the Google servers and pulls down all the calendars that I'm authorized to. And uh, there's basically only three things you can do with these. You can hide them off of your uh, view. You can select them. And you can assign a color to them. So I've already used this before. So it, uh, I've got uh, everybody hidden except for the people in my department. And I've got those selected. And there's only like four or five people in there. So we've got that. Once you do that, you can uh, make changes to it and save it. And then once you got the view the way you want it, if you want to change your, uh, actually apply the view, you just hit the apply button. And it goes out to the Google servers and uh, does its thing. Let's pull up the uh, browser here and here you can see part of my calendar here that um, it's just got the calendars that I selected in my view over there and their schedules on here so you can create as many views as you want let's create another one It's just going to be uh, all calendars go up here and use the menu to um, uncheck all the hidden ones and check all the selected check boxes so that now we're going to see every calendar that I'm authorized to and let's go ahead and save that now and we'll go back and apply that view and see what it looked like now after you hit the apply view when you go back to your browser, you need to hit F5 to refresh it so it uh, sees the changes that you've made. Okay, so that's done. Let's go back to the browser. I'm going to hit F5. Scoot it over some. Now you see that uh, we've got all these calendars in here. And even some down here. And then if you look over in the actual view, you see that it's very, very busy because they've got 91 calendars displayed. So, that's basically it. Now if I want to go back and just look at my department, I click my department and hit apply view. It does this thing again and of course I have to refresh the browser each time we change our view. That's done. Refresh the browser. And that cleans it up a good bit. I've just got the people that I selected in that in that view. So that's a quick way, instead of turning these calendars on and off, it's a quick way to uh, swap be between views. So the only other thing I didn't show was that uh, changing the colors. And that's as simple as clicking on the uh, color and then you get this little panel with the different colors that are allowed and you just click on the one you want it to be and then of course hit save to save your changes later on if you want to add more accounts just go here file and accounts and checkbox convenience methods and there's an about page and that's about it if you want to go check out my website you can hit more info and you'll be directed there so hope you uh, give google calendar views a try and uh, let me know what you think.